Hello everyone, it's Abby. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's cash stuffing video is for July paycheck number two. And if you notice, I don't have my usual shout outs in the beginning of the video. It's because I did ask in Instagram if you guys have any get to know me or random questions that you just want to ask me. And some people ask a few questions, so I'm going to answer that as I go through the cash stuffing and um, at the same time giving them a shout out. So that is exciting also thank you guys so much for being here for clicking this video i recently hit my 950 subscribers milestone and that really feels surreal until now i'm so so grateful for each and every one of you who support me we will stuff 415 dollars over here and um i think let's get into the video i mean the cash stuffing or the video <laughs> so i'm gonna start with my cash envelopes which are in here uh, you guys know that I've been using this for like almost every day now. I think every day now. So all my cash envelopes are here plus some receipts that I'm going to scan after I film today. But wow, I do have a lot of receipts to scan. Okay, so now I just have my cash envelopes with me and I do order... I did order a few envelopes, especially with my monthly bills. I re totally revamped it and added some sinking funds i'm excited to receive my new um purchases i also um, purchased the 100 envelope challenge kit from the bell studio design or bell's budget here in youtube so i'm really really excited i think i'll get it this week and you will probably see them on my next video so stay tuned for that but for now we just have the old ones <laughs> So spending will get fifteen dollars, and I just am going to get one ten and one five. Oh my god, I'm stuttering a lot. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I'm nervous filming this. Okay, so we have spending, and then eating out. Eating out will get thirty dollars, so we just get one twenty and two fives. Okay, I'm gonna answer one question. This one is from Karen and she asked me, um, how old am I? I'm actually 24. I am a March 1997 baby. I'm a Pisces, so where are my Pisces gang? <laughs> my introvert Pisces gang at? To be honest, I'm at the age where I'm, I am still 24, but I am already 24. You guys know that? I feel like I still have a long way to go, but at the same time, I'm pressured that I haven't accomplished a lot. <laughs> I don't know, do you guys experience those things? Because right now, recently, I'm having a lot of existential crisis. <laughs> so we have, uh, by the way, thank you girl for asking that. Um, groceries will get $40 and they'll just put two 20s. And then gas will get 20 Right now, it's almost $3. It's on the verge of being $3 per gallon. But I, I should up my gas money. But since my sister and dad are chipping in for weekly gas, um, I'm just going to stay with 20 They use my car at night. I don't know why they don't like using their cars. But <laughs> it's okay since they put gas on it every time they use it. So they use it at work. So I'm just going to stay with $20. By the way, guys, do you like my new accessories? I am addicted with, not really addicted, but I am into like butterflies lately. And <laughs> because of a K drama that I'm watching, I did buy a lot of accessories last weekend, which is a shame because I did use my spending money plus my some other money, buffer money. <laughs> but I did buy new cases. I don't know if you guys will appreciate new cases. Plus new accessories like this one, this one, and many more that I can't find. I also bought a new glass. <laughs> um, I think this is in preparation of our upcoming New York trip. But I'm just finding excuses to spend. Which is okay because it's a treat myself thing. But guys, butterfly, butterfly. <laughs> I never, I have I ever think that I'm going to get into butterfly things. But here I am. It's because of a gay drama, guys. And I really like this one. It has this thing where you can hold your phone safely. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, just too random. So that's it for my daily expenses. Okay, next is my sinking funds. 
Okay, we're gonna do it instead of my monthly bills. We'll do that last. So for future home, I'm not gonna put any. After this trip, after this month, I'm gonna start building this again. Then freedom money, I guess we'll get something I don't know, $10. So it will get $10. Then we have 50, 100, 150, 160, 65, 70, plus 500. So we have 670 for freedom money or three to six months worth of bills. And then for myself, I won't give, I mean, I won't get any. By the way, I'm proud because I still haven't spent the $10 that is in here. Sometimes when I run out of buffer or spending money in my cash envelope, I get the money from here. But last week I didn't. So proud moment right here. <laughs> and then health won't get any. Dentist will get five. Okay, I will answer another question. Okay, so we have 50, 100, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65. So the question is, what is my dream destination or travel place? Hmm, I don't think, I think I've answered this in my giveaway um, video, but I'm gonna say my top three, South Korea, Switzerland, and Japan. In the US, I think my, my um, dream travel destination is Hawaii and Colorado and New York so I'm gonna cross out New York since we're going there next week but yeah thank you guys so thank you I mean thank you Hanina for asking that go follow her in Instagram and also in YouTube she's a very very lovely person okay so we have Christmas and Christmas we'll just get two dollars today it's okay I am going to start building this after the whole trip I'm just focusing with my um pocket money so after oh wait <laughs> i did put some money in the beginning i mistakenly put them okay sorry this one is for christmas so we have 70 90 110 20 30 40 45 for christmas my goal now is 200 dollars for christmas and i think i'll be able to achieve that before the holiday so that's for Christmas. Adventure, aka my pocket money for next week, will get, I forgot how much, <laughs> $90. Oh my gosh. Have 50 and I think 20 and then two tens. So we have $90 for um, pocket money. Oh my gosh, I don't know how to. By the way, guys, I'm going to ask this question because I seriously don't know. <laughs> if i'm going to like have my pocket money in cash or do i transfer half of it into my debit card or i transfer everything in my debit card i don't know <laughs> because we're going into a different state for the first time so i just don't know how to do the whole new york trip or tourist thingy it might be more safe or safer if i just put everything in my debit card or probably like a portion of this into my debit card and then the rest in cash so yeah tell me how <laughs> tell me how you do yours because i have no freaking clue but wait i forgot to count this we have 70 90 110 30 50 60 70 80 90 200 200 10 220 i still have one more paycheck and i will close this at 300 before the trip so we have that and i also have my cushion or my buffer money for this just in case i run out or i <laughs> run out of money during that trip i'm kind of scared I, I i mean i'm not scared i mean i'm not gonna buy any luxurious item i'm just really there for the attraction for the experience also for the food so i think 300 dollars is okay for three days two nights i mean four days two nights we're gonna live with our relatives during our stay so we don't have to you know um think of that but yeah this is just purely for going around eating and whatever <laughs> so he, that's all gifts will get ten dollars my sister birthday is last day of july so i'm just gonna buy her cake and then i'm gonna give her the rest of the money that i'll stop in here she wants gym shorts something so i'm just gonna give her the money so she can buy it because i really don't know what she wants and she just 
agreed to just getting money from me i'm gonna still stuff this on my next paycheck so i think my goal here is 50 dollars 10 dollars for the cake and then 40 dollars to give to her as a gift <laughs> the vacation won't get any and then car needs won't get any but i need to do my car wash really soon my car is color white and obviously you can definitely see if it's dirty um it's just it's all it always rain in the afternoon so i feel like whenever i do my car wash it it rains and it gets dirty too quick because of the rain but yeah this re reminds me i need a car wash and then electronics will get two dollars by the way i took out my macbook pro in the marketplace because i realized that i need it some suddenly i miss it so i'm not ready to let that go <laughs> we have 10 2022 so i took it out and i'm still using it i don't know <laughs> i suddenly got cold feet in selling it so yeah that's for electronics taxes won't get any and then the rest won't get any so that's it for my sinking funds um nothing's going my way right now but the last binder that i'm going to stuff is my monthly bills and i did mention that i buy new envelopes bought new envelopes from etsy and all of these envelopes will be gone because i am totally revamping this whole binder i just want something more colorful don't get me wrong i like the minimalist black and white but with monthly bills i just feel like i want something colorful because I don't like stuffing them since they go away <laughs> easily but i hope that whenever i look at their envelopes i get more enthusiastic and more excited stuffing them so i know it's such a shallow reason but whatever i i, I like the envelopes that i ordered so stay tuned for that i have a new setup okay so before i proceed with my cash stuffing i will answer one question and it's from the cxp project she asked me one thing you are proud of by the way, do check her out. She's kind of new with the whole cash stuffing bits, but she's a really, really amazing and lovely person. I love talking to her in, through Instagram, so check her out. With regard to the question, one thing I'm proud of, hmm, probably when I passed my engineering licensure exam in the Philippines, wow, I really studied the, my heart out <laughs> during those times. I had a lot of mental breakdowns because of that licensure exam so when i got my engineering license i was like wow one of my proudest moment and i think my my parents was my parents were really really proud my whole family they even like put out a tarpaulin outside our house and also in the province when i was still in the philippines it's just like that's how proud they are and i'm proud of myself for that until now i still get chills whenever i think about the times that i reviewed for it the times that I cried because of it and the times during the after the exam and then the gap to the results because there was like a two week gap before we received the results wow that was like the most nerve-wracking two weeks of my life so I'm really proud that I was able to pass that so yeah thank you guys I'm I can't I keep saying thank you guys I mean thank you girl for asking that question so now we're gonna proceed with stuffing so rent rent will get sixty dollars oh my god where is it in here oh no it's 70. so rent will get 70 and we will just get 50. you know what i already have a guide in here but I'll, or i still messed up anyway uh we have 70 dollars for rent 120 130. i'm just gonna switch it out later <laughs> Then utilities, utilities will get 25, so just 120 and 15, so 20, 40, 50, 55. Okay, car loan. Oh, I was supposed to get the 50, but I put in the adventure as well. I was supposed, okay, before I answer car loan, since I'm kind of stressed out. <laughs> with my mistake i'm gonna answer the last question and that's from sanchez budgets or mrs sanchez budgets here in youtube girl she's a k-pop second generation k-pop fan i love it we are in the same wavelength with k-pop 
and i really love talking to her she's really supportive and her videos are all amazing so i hope you guys can check her out um she asked me where did you learn to edit like that <laughs> she has a comment i took a class in middle school and forgot it all <laughs> um editing i learned on my own <laughs> I love experimenting with cash stuffing videos. There's little to none editing that you can do, but since I want to compensate the my whole setup because I feel like I am kind of boring and my voice is not as engaging as the other people are, I try to be more visual and like in general, I'm a very visual person, so I really like putting a lot of media within media. Um, that's why I really try my best to put a lot of visuals, edit this the way I am imagine it, but I learned a lot from experimenting and making mistakes. So you guys, uh, I know editing is tough, but uh, my tip is I think it really just depends on the software or application that you're using. I'm currently using Velo. Okay, I promise you guys, I'm sorry if this is too long. Okay, this is what I use is Velo for my cash stuffing videos. It's in Velo. I use the premium version. It has a lot of um, features. Really love it. But I also use this one. Canva, Photoshop, Lightroom, Procreate, PixArt. Because again, I love visuals. So sometimes I create graphics in here and then move it to Velo so that I can play around or animate it. And for video, I think we have Velo, CapCut, video star perfect video CapCut, video star and perfect video i don't use use them a lot but below is like the my main editing app so sad that they don't have like a computer version they only have it for tablet and phone so i understand that it can be a little inconvenient especially if you only have like phone or like a small ipod it cannot i mean it's not the most convenient um editing software but for now, I am just doing good with Velo. Yeah, but that's the whole editing shenanigan. So I hope I answered a little bit of that question. I think I talk way too much also. But girl, thank you so much for asking. You, I mean, editing, you'll get there definitely. Trial and error is the way to go and experiment. A lot of resources that you can play around. And then YouTube for tutorials. There's a lot of YouTube tutorials. Definitely check that out. Okay, now continue with Carlone. Carlone will actually get $50. And okay, we have 50, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 200, 250, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, 305. So this one is for my July 20. 8th for july 28th um payment so we're done yay so we're good with car loan car insurance will get 60 so we have 20 40 60 i don't know if 65 uh, no it's 65 sorry okay i'm a mess this whole cash stuffing is a mess. I'm so sorry. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100 for car insurance. I'm scared because I can see some excess and I'm already at this. <laughs> already at my snowball debt. Snowball debt will just get 5. This is my best buy. Household won't get any. And then my phone will get, will get the rest. <laughs> Mess. okay we got 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 oh 50 okay we have 50 for my phone i forgot it's supposed to be 50 and then the remaining 11 dollars will go for my life insurance which i'm just gonna put on this little pocket because i don't have an excess envelope for it so that is for my life insurance and empty <laughs> we are done yay so this is for my monthly bills and that's it for this video thank you guys so much for watching if you do like this content don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button it means a lot to me and it also helps my channel and i hope you get to know me even for a little bit through the questions and 
yeah that's it thank you guys again so much for being here and i hope to see you on the next one bye